afternoon welcome to this video this is lecture number 25 we already covered 24 lecture and you know the book this is vector analysis by mr spiger book which is very important book for the bsc physics honors and mathematics honors as well this is very important book for it jam preparation that's why we decide to solve the supplementary problem with this book and today on this video we want to solve the supplementary problem 4.0 to 4.73 of chapter 4 which is considered a gradient and divergence and the previous or the all the lecture regarding to uh, solving the supplementary problem you get the playlist or link in the description box if you want you can go through the description box getting the total playlist okay so let's start today's question which says that a vector equal to this phi equal to this find the at this point this quantity okay so for that you just put first divergence of a you know what is the divergence this is this grad operator is i cap del del x j cap del del y k cap del del z dot a vector a vector mean i cap a x j cap a y and k cap a z so if we uh, dot the i i one so this can be written at del a x del x del a y del y del a z del z so l a x equal to this part so this is del del x of 3 x y z square plus del del y of 2 x y cube plus del del z of minus x square y z what do you get with respect to x this will be 1 so 3 y z square with respect to y this will be 6 x y square with respect to z this will be gives x square y okay so at this point so divergence of a at the point is given 1 minus 1 1 so if you put this 1 minus 1 so 3 minus 1 1 square plus 6 1 minus 1 square minus 1 square into minus 1 you will get this is the minus 3 this is the plus 6 and this is the plus 1 so this will be 4 go to the next question a dot grad phi so you need to find out the grad phi so what is the grad phi grad phi you know i cap del phi del x plus j cap del phi del y plus k cap del phi del z so i cap del phi del x phi is this 3x square minus yz if you respect to x you will get 6x you will get 6x plus j cap if you with respect to y you will get minus z and k cap with respect to z we will get minus y so at the point at 1 minus 1 so if you put at this point that is grad phi at 1 minus 1 1 put this value 6 into 1 6 i cap z is 1 so this is minus j cap y is minus 1 so this is plus k cap now we can find out the dot product so a dot o oh, a vector at that point we need to find out a vector at that point so a a at 1 minus 1 1 what will be the value equals to if this <laughs> put this value you will get uh, minus 3 i cap minus 3 i cap and here this is minus also minus 2 j cap and here we put this, value, this minus so this is plus k cap and if you want to find out a divergence of grad phi just dot product you know this is minus 18 j j1 so this is plus 2 kk1 plus 1 so this will be nothing but minus 15 so answer of this question is this go to the c which c is divergence of divergence of phi a using identity you can say this is phi of divergence a plus grad phi dot a you already know the value of 
the grad phi grad grad phi you know this is the grad phi and divergence a also you know divergence a is 4 sorry divergence a is this value is 4 and grad phi also known this is nothing but grad phi also known this is 6 i minus j plus k 6 i minus j plus k 6 i minus j 6 i minus j plus k and the a a vector at that point you also know minus 3 minus 2 plus k minus this a vector is minus 3 minus 2 plus k we need to find phi at that point we need to find out the phi at that point phi is 3 x square minus y z phi is 3 x square minus y z and the point is point is 1 minus 1 1 so 1 minus 1 1 if we put this is 3 into 1 3 and 1 minus 1 so 1 this will become 4 so this will be 4 so just multiply this is 16 and this multiplication you give minus 18 uh, plus 2 plus 1 which will give you the minus 15 16 minus 15 which is nothing but 1 go to the next d d is says divergence of grad phi so grad phi is this we derivative with respect to so divergence of grad phi grad phi is i cap 6x i cap 6x uh, minus z cap y achha, plus j cap minus z plus k cap minus y so you know this is the i cap del del x j cap del del y so this will be del del x of 6x plus del del y of minus z plus del del z of minus y so this will be nothing but 6 this is 0 0 so answer of this question is 6 go to the next question evaluate divergence of this so divergence of this that means divergence of this 2x square z i cap minus x y square z j cap plus 3y z square k cap divergence is nothing but i cap del del x plus j cap del del y plus k cap del del z dot this is i cap 2x square z minus j cap x y square z plus k cap 3y z square so just dot you get del del x of 2x square z plus del del y of minus x y square z plus del del z of 3y z square so with respect to x we will get 4 x z 4 x z with respect to y minus 2 x y z with respect to z this is 6 y z this is the solution or divergence of this okay go to the next question let phi equal to this grad grad square phi so you need to find out the grad square phi is nothing but divergence of grad phi right so at first you need to find out the grad phi grad phi means i cap del phi del x j cap del phi del y k cap del phi del z so what is the value i cap del phi del x with respect to x we get 6 x z um, plus 12 x square y plus 2 plus j cap del phi del y that is 2 y z cube plus 4 x s cube minus 3 plus k cap del z del phi del z with respect to z this will be 3 x square minus 3 y square z square okay now divergence of grad phi that's mean i del del x of that that is 6 x z plus 12 x square y plus 2 plus del del y of that that is minus 2 y 
जेड क्यू प्लस फोर एक्स स्क्यू माइनस थ्री प्लस डेल डेल जेड ऑफ थ्री एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस थ्री वाई स्क्वायर जेड स्क्वायर सो पार्शियल डेरिवेटिव विद रेस्पेक्ट टू एक्स यू विल गेट सिक्स जेड या ट्वेंटी फोर एक्स वाई या विद रेस्पेक्ट टू वाई दैट इज माइनस टू जेड क्यू विद रेस्पेक्ट टू वाई नथिंग विद रेस्पेक्ट टू जेड माइनस सिक्स वाई स्क्वायर जेड ओके दिस इज द सॉल्यूशन ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन गो टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इवेल्युएट गेट स्क्वायर एल एन आर शो गेट स्क्वायर एल एन आर दैट इज ओके गेट स्क्वायर मीन्स डाइवर्जेंस ऑफ ग्रेडियंट ऑफ आर like that you know you know the uh, you know this is nothing but the uh, simply derivative with uh, simply derivative uh, with a r cap right so you can say uh, the r cap is nothing but r vector by r so this is okay so you can say this is phi a phi means 1 by r square phi and a is this so this can be written as gradient of 1 by r square dot dot r vector plus divergence of r into 1 by r square clear so this will be again a derivative so minus if it is this is the minus 2 by r cube with r cap r cap means r vector by r dot r vector and divergence of r divergence of r divergence of r so divergence mean i cap del del x j cap del del y k cap del del z dot r cap is i cap x plus j cap y plus k cap z so this is del 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 x of x that is 1 1 1 so this is a constant value 3 so you can put 3 and this is 1 by r square so here this is 2 by r to the power 4 minus 2 by r to the power 4 and r dot r is r square plus 3 by r square so this is minus 1 by one by r square minus sorry my uh, 2 by r square plus 3 by r square so this is 1 by r square so answer of this question is 1 by r square Thank you this is all about me and this is my contact details you can contact with my whatsapp and telegram channel for querying regarding physics and this is my youtube channel details you go through this channel and you get all the videos regarding the physics and other competitive examination or if you are new in uh, new in this channel subscribe this channel and press the bell icon to get the notification when i uploaded the new video thank you take care of you we will meet in the next video as soon as possible